Success, socially, but even not socially, the true measure of success is how much are you smiling and how much are you laughing? That's really it. It's not a serious thing, especially socializing. If you go the serious route, no one wants to hang out and talk to someone who's serious all the time. Or if you're going the route where it's this big deal for you, no one wants to be around that. And even on your end, it's like, why are you even in this? Are you in this to like master the serious chess piece that is socializing and win? Or are you there to have crazy fun experiences, epic experiences, right? That's a successful life. Again, everyone has a different measure of like, oh, that's my result. But part of my result is like, I want to laugh until the day I die. I want to be laughing while I'm dying. That'll be it. Everyone's like, what's your last words? Don't you mean last laugh? <laughs> that'd be it. That'd be my, that, that's how I'd go out, right? Um, and I'm aware of it. I'm always aware of it. And I take note of it. And, um, you know, once you find, too, like something that makes you laugh, you can also reuse it temporarily, right? If you find something funny, like, say, the, the book thing, I could say that for the next few days and still find it funny. But I'm auditing, do I still genuinely find it funny or not? As soon as it turns into this thing now that I'm trying to do, it's done. And then you better find the new, genuine thing that you find funny. And once more, you can also laugh at awkward situations, times you run out of things to say, times where it's weird. Just, just laugh at how weird it is. Get yourself in weird situations. Take note of it. Trust me, if you have that, everyone wants to be around it. The three, you could say, moods or emotions that are contagious and people want, fun, carefree, passion. Everyone wants to laugh, have more fun. That has so much value. Everyone wants to be more carefree. Everyone cares way too much. Right? Everyone's so stuck up. And everyone wants to be part of something exciting and passionate. People are bored. Their lives are boring. No joke, most of you here, probably you're bored with your life like crazy. Especially the past, what, two years now. You know. People stayed stuck inside. Most people are so bored. They just want anything. They're like, just give me anything. Even in a seminar like this, I could like make, like, like, like Owen was doing before, I could make some funny sounds, and what I'm saying could make zero sense, but you probably just love it because it's better than nothing. You're like, there's some life and some passion and some fun. I could just be like, fun, ha, ha. fun, fun, fun. There's a laugh. It made no sense. You're just like, it's better than boring value, yeah. right? There's that famous saying, um, uh, uh, who says this? It was in a, I'm not sure who originally said it, but it's in a, a marketing book. Um, John Carlton, John Carlton. It's in uh, one of his books. He's like, you know, when it comes to marketing, realize like people are bored and this is like the average life of a person, right? They wake up in their boring bed from boring dreams that they just had. Then they walk to you know, their boring bathroom, take their boring piss, go down, eat their boring breakfast, reading their boring stuff on their phone, do their boring commute, listening to boring music, to see their boring coworkers, do their boring job, eat their boring lunch, come back, watch something boring on TV, eat something boring, and go back to bed and dream boring dreams, and that's their boring life on repeat. Boring, boring, boring. It's crazy. Right? And the only escape they have is maybe a little TikTok here to see if someone else is doing something not boring. Right? So just that, like, you can audit too. It's like, how many people do you know in your life who are truly passionate about something? Right? Like, you just see it. Like, when they talk about it, they light up. It's like there's that life force in them. Probably very few. Right? And it's, it's getting worse and worse. It's, it's really sad on a more societal level. But what does that mean on your end? The bar is so low. You just gotta be a little bit less boring than most and you have value, <laughs> for real. Like that's how low the bar is. Same with fun, same with laughter. People are just getting so bland, so bland on all levels, scared of any kind of uniqueness, scared of standing out, scared of honoring what they care about, just turning into, again, back to the matrix, little batteries in the matrix, to the point where if you could just, you'd probably just notice a result if you just added a bit more smiling to your day-to-day -day life. You already stand out, right? You'll see the most, I mean, from traveling, there's different types of conditioning. You know, like overall, yes, there's same conditioning everywhere, but it does vary country to country. And one country where people are so stifled is uh, Finland. It's crazy. It's, people have so much trouble smiling there that if you smile, you stand out like crazy. 
and you have so much value just by smiling. That's how low the bar is. Literally, it's like a smile, and people are like, oh, smile, and they'll rush because you're like smiling. Now, that's slowly happening here too. Start smiling. 